Hey, it's been like a book blitz on the sales of my latest book, Fishing the Edge, Techniques and Tales from Surfboat and Kayak. Um, I really appreciate that, viewers. It's labeled the bestseller on Amazon. You can learn more at johnskinnerfishing.com and on Amazon. Okay, here's where we're headed with this one, and this is my first ocean fluke fishing trip of the season, and it is a great one. All right, we're in about 90 feet of water. We're out in uh, Rick's Metal Shark, and we've got uh, Cliff up there in the bow, and Jack's up there somewhere, and uh, all right, let's just get to the action. And I'm just making my first drop of the season here, and we're going to get right into them. I'll have links to all of the gear in the video description, and if you like this video, please hit the like button. If you're not already a subscriber, please subscribe and hit that notification bell. This is Eastern Long Island. What are you guys using for weight? Really? I dropped to the four also. Yep, first ocean drop of the season here. I'm just uh, adjusting the, the drag on my reel. 15-pound uh, test braid. Yeah, you got to make sure you've got your drag adjusted because uh, you get a big fish. They definitely, they can pop that line. Did anybody take out drag? Ned? Ned, get the hell out of here, Ned. No, I got the wrong species. Oh, thank God, you got some uh, decent fish there. Oh, that looks good, Cliff. Way to go. Luck, beginner's luck. Nice. Whoa, nice. nice. Way to start. Whoa. Dumb luck. I catch my fish in here. Dumb luck. Yeah, we're catching a bunch Let's of... Let's see what you got there. Yeah. Nice. Way to start. Hey, yeah. that's like, no, you know... That's like a four or five pounder. That's, that's no? at least five. Not much different than the one that <laughs> won the con, yeah. won the money for us. Yeah. Except, except thank you, Skinner, for that money, by the way. <laughs> hey, Rick uh, drove us over that fish. Yeah, that's right. I put you on the fish. So how can you said that that? Oh. I think it's the wrong guy again. Yeah, shoot. Oh, maybe not. That's a fluke. It's a fluke? Yeah. You did that? Uh, no, I don't think so. Of course, I say that, and then... And then there'll be a 20 pounder. I think that's a keeper, huh? Well, he's worth a minute. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. It's, uh, the rumor's right over there by the hose. Oh, yeah, he's definitely good. Yeah, yeah you know what it is? I saw Cliff's fish, and now everything looks small. Yeah, I don't know if he. I meant to ask him if he sells this. Oh, look, look, look. Yeah. What do you got there, Cliff? Because I'll net it if it's. I'm good, I think. I don't know. Don't get the ah, you're coming up awful fast. You need that? Cliff, I'll come up. Huh? Yeah. Is it coming? I got him. I got him, Jack. Yeah, nice fish, Cliff. Good. Way to go. Hey, look at that. And I unhooked them for you. Thanks, sir. All right, a good drift is a huge part of being successful, this kind of fishing. And right now, we've got a very slow drift, and uh, you really would like it to be at least a half a mile an hour. And, uh, yeah, we're, we're not there at all. So uh, we're thinking about what we might do about that. Uh, point three. Okay. Barely. Well, I mean, if we can turn on the I know. We, we may end up doing that. I mean, point three is really down there. And we're kind of not going in the right direction. And 
we know there's fish here. That's the other thing. Yeah. Yeah, it's solid point three. I don't think so. I don't think so. Oh, definitely. I take it back. That's a keeper. I think it is. Yeah, I think. I don't know why they. Just one bucktail on it. Well, you know, that does work Work well. I mean, that's why I brought that extra rod with me. I, I, I get the approach. Obviously, not going to. There you go. Oh, yeah. Way to go, Rick. Okay, I'm coming over. That's a good one. No doubt about this one. I think so. Got the nice shakes and the weight. Right. <laughs> no chance. Not a this is chance. bigger than the one you you caught. Yeah, really. And you the, saw that hook set too, huh? Yes, I actually I did. It was very aggressive. Good fish, yeah. That's a nice fish. Damn straight. Now, I, I, I uh, need to hear how this is Okay, slow it down. Not so fast. Okay, release there you the go. drag. Go fish, catch another. All right. I'll take care of this. All right. All right, so clearly this fish here, they're eating, but we are not covering any ground. The drift is, is very slow. Um, you'd like to be between 0.5 and 1.5 miles an hour. So we're going to kick in the trolling motor, and we're, we're making a troll here, and uh, we'll, we'll see if it helps us. Oh, oh, you got yourself a keeper there, right? Yeah. You got a fish? Maybe. Maybe. I thought you were tangled with... with uh, yeah, we are. Yeah, we are. So the trolling motor really didn't help us. Um, you know, you think about when you're drifting broadside in a 32-foot boat, you've got a nice spread on the lines. You don't have that as much here. And you know what? It just didn't get us anything additional, so back to drifting. Head, head shaking? I got the pot, or uh, maybe, I, I don't know, I, I, hope I hopefully I don't have Rick's line. I don't have the pot, but I don't know what I got here. So anyway, maybe we hit a couple of sea bass or something, I don't know. I think I momentarily hit the line on that uh, fish trap. Uh, short fluke for me. He's got a big keeper. What do you got there? I'm going to come, uh, I'm going to take care of Rick. All right, here we go. Here's my fish. Well, no, uh, you know what? He's a keeper, but yeah. Nice. Way to go, Rick. No need to measure that guy. Thanks, Jack. I was gonna, I was trying to get over there, but I had to get that fish back. Seven. Okay. Okay, here we go. Another one. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Nick, get him in there. Okay, we coming. I mean, look, he's not going to be big, but since you're already around, you know. It's not going to be big. Actually, it feels pretty good. Yeah. Looks like a nice Yeah, it's definitely band. a fluke, yeah. Yeah, no, it's good, yeah. Here we go. Got color. Nice. All right. Not as big as cliffs, but more ricks. <laughs> well, you know how to set that drift up again. 
So that's a simple rig that's a 30 pound test fluorocarbon. There's a loop on the bottom. There's a dropper loop one foot above that. On the dropper loop is a Tsunami uh, silicone skirt teaser. And on the bucktail, that's an S&S Skinner swing hook fluke bucktail. And those are six inch gulp grubs on both hooks. And I'll have links to all of that in the video description. Okay, I got the net here. Cause, uh, what do you got there, Joe? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Decent. 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 I think we should put that back patrolling motor. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you, right by these. This, uh, yeah, no. So we know that. Maybe we're going to pound that. Yeah. Oh, boy. Right past these uh, <laughs> lobster pot there. Cliff wants to go to the windmills. Cliff, I'm surprised you didn't say the ling spot. No, this spot's working out well. Why would I want to go somewhere else and catch a fish? That's a good we, fish. Because you're Cliff. You know? <laughs> yeah, right, exactly. Found spot. Nice, right Jack. That's spot. a good one. Wow. Yeah, that's going to be, uh, you got pool fish coming up now. See, I told you there's a, maybe a moose down there. That could be the moose. He's got the 14 pounder here. And he didn't even say anything. He said this feels heavy. When he says that, you yes. better you better have the net. Yeah, and that comment is both Jack and Cliff have caught fluke of around 14 and a half pounds on this boat. You too. What's the yeah, big pressure? Uh, yeah, there is no Slow and steady there. wins the race. That's Slow the and steady wins the race. Oh, holy moly. I see it from here. Okay, holy bring him up and turn him around. Bring him over. We'll get him. Wow. Nice fish. Oh, nice oh, one, Jack. Beauty. That's a Montauk Plus. That's an Great oh, fish. Yeah. Right? Wow. Yeah, uh, I don't catch a lot solid, of fish. Solid moose! Mm. Way to go, Jack. Nice fish. Thank you. Thank Let's you, see if we can get him out of the... Yeah. So that's uh, nine. Fish right here that, uh... That's what yeah, we come out for. It's not like making an integrated circuit. Someone else can do it. Oh, oh, oh. I don't know what is. I thought I foul hook another. It's this is. It's not a legit hook fluke. It, actually, I wouldn't. I wouldn't even doubt that this is a monk fish. <laughs> I swear to God. Well, we'll see if I see a spin. I don't see it. Yeah, it's too early to see it. I gotta tell you, it feels so monkish. And I did say. Yeah, I gotta tell you, this is, you know, I have a lot of experience with these. I've caught two of them in my life, and because he just doesn't, you know what? Now he's, he's a, probably a fouled fluke. Yeah, it's swinging around and around. Yeah, it's a fouled fluke, I guess. Skate. No, I don't know what the hell. Oh, it's a monk! Get the net! It's a monk! <laughs> I told you, Cliff. I told you. <laughs> okay, Cliff, there you go. I, I, I follow through. That's right, I've never said it. I've never said it. <laughs> Yeah, it's only the third one I've caught in my life. It's actually the third one I've, I've ever seen caught. And uh, for whatever reason, um, I was sitting next to Cliff on the way out, and I said, I'm going to catch a monkfish today. <laughs> and, and there it is. So pretty lucky. Uh, the net's free, so I'll take care of that. All right. uh, I don't know. Ah, I think so. Yeah. Especially, I called it pretty early in the yeah, yeah. <laughs> in the lift. Oh yeah, nice. Oh, uh, it's not that big, but it's a keeper. It's a nice fish. Yeah, yeah. He just came in on a funky angle there. 
All right. It's uh, what, 11 or 12? It's 11. So that's 11. Those are the ugliest fish, but they are spectacular eating. Oh, thanks for sharing that with us. Yep. Yeah, otherwise... Um, I've got that on video too, so that's good. Yep. That's good shaking. Yeah, yeah. Do you think it could be a keeper? Is there weight? It might be. It okay. Might be. I'm not going to fool around then. Let's go. Definitely heavier than the rest. I think a keeper, yeah, keeper, yeah. Number twelve. Fourteen up here. Okay, oh, all right. I'm gonna just go to Cliff. Okay. Yeah, Cliff. Yeah, maybe. Oh, okay. I'm coming up. Oh no, I see that. I see that. It looks good. I'm gonna go on the other side of you. It's just I couldn't get through all the. All right. Just watch my ear, guys. I don't even think any beef, but we'll see. Well, we'll see, buddy. We'll see. That was a, uh, you know, I had the net in my hand. Had the net in my hand. I get it. I think he's good. I don't know. Come, you know that. Yeah, yeah, he's good. Swing him around, swing him around, thank you. Alright, he's all yours. Three more to go. Alright, New York orders. We are allowed four fish each at at least 18 and a half inches. We have 13 in the boat. Come on, Rick. Put, put it to him. I think so, huh? Yep. Excellent, well done. You got one on too? Get, and then you should get a mark on the spot. Rod, thank you. Right, take care of it. Mine is nothing. Okay. No, I'm not even Coming your way, Rick. Okay. Yeah, that's good, for sure. Yeah. Yeah, definitely a fluke. You know what? It's heavy. Definitely a keeper. Nice fish. Oh, that's a nice. Nice. Beauty. <laughs> okay, get, oh. get the mark. Oh, uh, that oh, deserves a mark. Oh, well, all right. Yeah, because this is about the same thing. What happened up there? I got to keep All right, way to go. And you swung them, huh? Yeah, you know. That's all right. They're the best fillets. All right, it might be one more to go. It should be one more to go. No, it's a keeper. I think. No? All right. So, he's he's a keeper? Yeah. And you, you know what fillets I pull, like that. It's a I pull from the, the bucket, right? right. I really like the thin one ones. probably no bigger, right? It doesn't matter. He's fouled anyway, but yeah. Okay. We're, I'll let him go. Okay. Put that in the box, and we're done. All right, a very fast 16 fish boat limit, and actually we had 17 fish. All right, if you like this video, please hit the like button. If you're not already a subscriber, please subscribe and hit that notification bell. Check out my online courses at saltstrung.com slash Skinner. And don't forget my new book, Fishing the Edge, Techniques and Tales from Surfboat and Kayak, available at johnskinnerfishing.com and on Amazon.